Sharky Breath. He plays video games. Hello, and welcome back to One Shot. All right, so I, I found the document. Um, I actually had no idea where it was. See, but uh, I looked at the computer again, and it was like, you need to find a document. It's found a good place for documents to be. Do you know where to find documents? So I was like, yeah, okay, it's in the document folder. So I checked in my document folder, and there's this note, which I'm going to try and just, like, eh, there you go. So as you can see, it's mostly garbage, but here's what we got here. It says, dear illegible, illegible, something, something message to you, and I'm afraid I must make it brief. I have left you a journal, part of which is written in a language that blah, 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 blah. And if H, something, 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 read it and you will know what to do. I have also left you a mask book, I can't read it, you, there's, it says you in the middle there and then there's a bunch more garbage. Look for a metal safe in the quarry to the east, somewhere between the ocean and the lookout Point. The code you need is 409936. That was probably kind of awkward, but I don't have a better idea. So, oh, uh, here, let me actually clear that away. Haha, <laughs> professional. And now it's right next to it, so I can tell what this, the code is. Hooray! So, back to it. Let's, um, hmm. I suppose let's try and, uh, well, obviously we need to open up that safe, right? But I also kind of want to check in with Silver. See if uh, she has anything new to say, given that we've just activated the activated the power plant. You know, it seems like that would be good news for her. I don't know. She seems like she could use some good news. But I guess the safe's going to be on the way to Silver's place, isn't it? So, I guess let's do that first? Question mark? Sure. Maybe that's... Uh, oh, wait. The note totally implies that the gas mask is in the safe. So, let's let's do the safe first. Yeah. Metal safe. Seems like it locked with a six-digit uh, six code. Yes, it is. I don't remember seeing any six-digit codes. Do you, Sharky? I do. So, let's do this. Four, zero, nine, nine, three, six. Whoa, it worked! Wait, how did you know the code, Sharky? I still don't remember seeing one. I, uh, had some help. It's true, I did. Really? From who? <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Nico. Okay. What's in the safe, Nico? What's in the safe, Nico? Oh, right. Let's see. Ah, I found a gas mask. Also, there's this weird-looking book. I can't read it, though. Not that I can't read or anything, because I can. I just don't know what language this is. Okay. That's fair, I guess. Whoa! Hey, whoa, 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 what is that? What is that? I, that's what I'm wondering. Uh. Uh. Okay. Let's see here. Strange journal. Found in the Barrens. It's written in an unknown language. Huh. Okay, well, I don't like the looks of that right there. Not much at all, I'm afraid. But let's, uh. I, what am I doing? I can fast travel. Travel to... Lookout point? Is that where Silver hangs out, I think? Hey. Hey, you. Do you need further assistance? We're good, thanks. Uh, maybe. Let me let me show you the journal. Do you have any idea what this business is? Excuse me, miss. I found this book. Do you know anything about it? Let me see. What language is this? I'm sorry, I don't even recognize this writing system. Ah, well, it was worth a shot. Although, this insignia... Hold on to the journal for now. It will be important. Okay. <laughs> Cryptic. Thank you, Silver. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's. I'm right. I'm inside a house. Forgot. Forgot. Okay. Let's travel to. I'm guessing the profit bot isn't going to be much assistance in this, but let me try anyway. Hello again. Are there more? No, no, no. I don't have any questions. I just wanted to show you this journal. But I guess that's not an option. Oh, you know what? There were robots in the factory, weren't there? I should see if the ro factory robots are active. And also put the journal away. There we go. Hey, they are! Hey, guys! Oh, hello. Hi! I have power again. 
Yep. Great. Hello, organic life form. <laughs> hello. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Meaningful interactions. Oh, hello. You're gonna... T yep, apparently that's it. Oh, hello. Great. Anything up here? Just bits of robots. Were there any that were intact? I think there were not. Okay. Well, great. I've talked to all the robots, I think. So that was... That's accomplishing something, for sure. Okay, so let's venture into the poison gas, I guess. Wait, this isn't the way to the poison gas. Um, well, first off, let me put my... Uh, let's get there first. Is it... Oh, wait a second, this guy! I didn't talk to this guy. Oh, he's standing up. Hello, small person. You're not much bigger than I am. Welcome to the lookout point. Below us is the old quarry. The head engineer lives a little more to the east. Wait, silver? The entrance to the old mines is further to the east. I see. Great. Thank you. Just gonna gaze off into the quarry, huh? Well, that's your prerogative, robot friend. Um, let's go this way. This is the way to the poison gas, right? Right, okay. Let's pop on that gas mask. I'll wear it when I have to. Okay, apparently Nico's got that covered. There we go. I sure be fine with this mask on. <laughs> I tried to do a mask. I, I thought about trying to do a, vo a mask on voice, but I feel like that would get obnoxious. But, but I don't know. It's a gas vent. Yes, it is. And there's pipes and lumps. Apparently, there's not going to be much purpose in inspecting all the gas vents, but I figured I would give it a shot. Um. So, is there anything of interest in here besides deadly gas? Hmm? Tell me that, why don't you? Nope! It sure doesn't looking like it. Oh, wait. Here we go. Here we go. This is something. Hello? Oh, it's not, it's not poison gassy in here. Hello? Hello, person. Welcome to the old chemical processing plant. Most of the equipment has already been relocated. Okay. Sure. At least he recognizes I'm a person. I bet Nico appreciates that. I shouldn't say I. It's not me. It's Nico. What's this? It's a pair of rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. Cool. That's probably going to come in handy. If I need to pull that battery out, I could use those, but, you know, turning off all the robots in the process. Hello, person. The robot assembly repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. If you have further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. I suppose that's silver, isn't it? Now I know that. Okay, what's this? This seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here is a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Reagents, acidic gas, blue phosphor, rare form. Uh, whoops. Sorry about that, I clicked off the thing. Instructions, in a well-ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. That's the end of the page. Okay. Well, I do have a container. I have a bottle. I don't know how much good it'll do us. I can probably crowbar my way in here, can't I? I no, I don't want to fast travel. There we go. Good thing I kept this crowbar. Indeed. What could possibly be, uh... What a workout. There's probably nothing dangerous behind the boarded off region, right? Probably not. This robot looks kind of rusty. Yeah, they apparently all do. Um, why is there an army of robots over here? A bunch of robots without power. I guess the generator can only do so much. I guess you're right. Yeah, okay. Okay. Well, let's read this note. I was just worried that it might trigger something when I read the note. This seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Two, without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into the container. Three, shake vigorously to initiate the reaction. Four, use as soon as possible. Note, if elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Also note, hand protection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. Okay. I don't know what half of these words mean. It's a good thing you're here, Sharky. I guess. But I feel like we've... You know as much as I do. A cleaning sponge with a rough surface. Okay. Why did that one make a different noise than all the other ones? I have no idea. What's this? It's a big metal box with complicated machinery inside. 
Okay, are they, are they all that? They are complicated machinery, you say. Well, very well. I guess that's, uh, that's that for this place. Great. Complicated machinery? Yes. All right. Let's keep moving, I guess. All right. Poison gas. Almost forgot. Is there anything back here? Anything in the backyard? Given that there is a backyard, I feel like there probably has to be something back here, doesn't there? I guess that's not true. That doesn't have to be anything anyplace. That was broken. Got rocks, vents, empty pools. Hey, 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 what's this? There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than the others. The few who work directly with gas look harvesting look practically new. Is that a result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? Okay, maybe. Who are you? Whoa, okay, where am I going? Uh, out of the poison gas, apparently. This is a new region, I think. I think? Yeah, this looks a little different. I mean, it looks very similar to the- Whoa, boy! That's a big old robot. Hi! Can I talk to you? Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm? A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. To this world, I mean. See? I have the sun. Oh, the messiah. I do not know what to say. Greeting you is not part of my programming. Have you spoken to ProfitBot? I think so, yeah. ProfitBot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, he cannot speak with anyone else. <laughs> really? At least, not with ease. Oh, that's kind of sad. It, I agree. What are you built for, then? My purpose is to guard this settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Ah, why, though? I have not been tamed. Okay, seriously, somebody has to explain to me what taming means. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. Really? Hmm. I guess that's all he has to say on the matter. Anything else, man? By the way, some robots may start following you around the settlement as well. Do not be alarmed. It is their job to keep people safe. I feel like I will be alarmed anyway, but thanks for the warning. Okay, so the settlement, huh? Let's check it out. Okay, what's this? Looks like they're evacuating the few tamed robots we have here. Makes sense. No point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going too. From what I can tell, no. Let's see whose power source this is. It's a power cell, I think. There's writing on this one too. It says, Guardian of Residential Area. Okay, so the guy outside. Lots of tiny shrimp swimming in this jar. It's looking a little dim. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Guardian, your, your power source. Apparently, phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big ships started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. They said it was due to something with squares? I'm not sure what they meant by that. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transport most of these surplus bots to the city at, at this rate. And we worked so hard on those. So those are the ones in the, uh, the storage facility I was just in. But I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as it is. I think it's going to be our turn soon. Okay. I don't know who's writing these, but okay, that's a big ladder. This is... I'm scared of ladders. You're scared of ladders. Does that mean we can't use the ladder? Yeah, I think that means we can't use the ladder. Okay, so no climbing ladders. Can I... No. Okay, I can look at this. What am I looking at? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing to say about that, Nico, huh? Very well. Let's, uh... Oh, hi. Unit RM2883417 reporting for duty. I saw that you spoke with the Guardian of the Settlement. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. Um, what? Uh, okay. So, I'm being followed by a robot now. I don't know where my dormitory is. I'm kind of glad that he's not trying to just shove me someplace. Hello? All of these terminals do not boot. I am not sure what to do now. That's, that's fair, man. I don't, I'm not sure either. Let me just, uh, hey. Checking. Checking. Terminal does not respond. This is a problem. Probably true. Some of the ink on this page is faded. 
likely due to some sort of electrical or magnetic interference. I'm afraid this operation can no longer be sustained if the servers continue to fail so much that maintenance cannot keep up the pace. Fortunately, it does not seem to be happening to the robots, at least not at a significant rate. Time will tell. Okay, so all the computers were not built to last well enough, and so they're all, uh, they're all toast. That is a shame. I see that I lost my robot escort. Oh, there he is! Run away! Run away! Hide in the dormitory! What's this? No, I don't, I don't want to look at that. Nico, I don't want to look at that. I want to look at this. This. I remember being taught in school about how the waters surrounding the forest stretched until the boundaries of space. But at some point, the prehistoric oceans receded, forming what is now the Barrens. I wonder where all that water went. Fair question. Or maybe they just had no idea of how far the water went, and the Barrens were here the whole time. Could be. Oh, right. You don't like ladders. Sorry, sorry, Nico. Sorry. I know. Yep, yep, yep. What's this? Tiny shrimp. Great. All right. So what about the left west dormitory? Number eight here. What do we got? Anything different in number eight? Ladder. Don't even look at it. What's this? A picture of a robot. You know, I've never been around so many robots before, Sharky. Or any robots at all. I mean, I see them in cartoons and stuff, but I've never seen one in person. They're pretty neat, don't you think? Uh... <laughs> yeah, or, hey, Nico, do a robot voice. <laughs> I mean, they gave me the option, so... What? Try talking like a robot, sure. Um... <clears throat> Beep boop. <laughs> I'm a robot and I eat batteries instead of normal people food <laughs> that is not correct uh oh uh oh we've upset the natives robots do not consume batteries in the same way people consume food in fact robots do not possess digestive systems some robots do not even have mouths some robots do not even have senses of humor come on man sharky you made me look silly I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't know he was up there. How could have I have known he was up there? Hello. Hi. What are you doing up there? I am stationed here. By yourself? Yes. Okay. Well, good. Good talk. Good talk. All right. Is there any other dormitories around here? Whoops. Hello. Sorry about that. I thought I put that into silent mode. Apparently not. Let's, uh, check this one out. Hey, sweetie. Six more weeks until you can come home. About time, huh? Gosh, I can't imagine living in that awful capsule wall dorm thing. But guess what? Soon you'll get to sleep in a real bed and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, Mom. Aw. So, these are dormitories and people slept in these little chambers. That seems like a genuinely bad time. Looks like we're supposed to pack stuff for the evacuation starting today. I wish these books weren't so heavy. It's going to be a pain to carry them onto the ship. But they're by the author. I can't just throw them away. The author, huh? Cryptic. They seem to like the cryptic things. Oh, hello. Are you a different one? Yes, you are. It's unit R RT3874-7201 reporting for duty. It seems that you have already have an assigned escort. Unit RM2883417. Would you like me to leave? You can follow me if you want. Understood. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. <laughs> okay. Am I supposed to just gather a whole gang of robots? Is that the idea? I could do that. What's this? Evacuation? At such short notice? I can't believe this. First the sun dies, now I'm out of job. Well, apparently that's it. This must be a picture. Some sort of mechanical drawing. Okay. Sure. Anything else? Oh, broken robot. Hello. A robot. It's beyond repair. Okay. Anybody up there? I'm nervous now. Now that I know that there can be robots up there, I feel like I have to check. <laughs> nope. Nope. All clear in here. Alright. Let's see. Let's see. Where else is there to go? I wish I had a local map, you know? Like, the, the map in the... in the, uh... Outpost is nice and all, but whoops. Gas. We got gas. Uh, I, I didn't want to leave the dormitory area, actually. But yeah, it's it's very vague. It's more sort of a world map than a regional map, and I could uh, really use one of the latter, I would think. 
Whoa, 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 what's this? Hello? Infirmary. Oh, this is the infirmary. This building is the infirmary. Hey, I haven't talked to you yet. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Cool, thank you. I guess let's check out the infirmary. Oh, you're an infirmary bot, I see. Hello, person of organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. I like how you all have your own customized greetings. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected, none. Treatment required, none. You are good to go. Uh, thanks? Great, so we're good to go. That's good to know. What's this? It's a box of medical tools. Most of them are broken or rusted beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Is it okay for me to just take it? I mean, I guess. Hello? Hello, person? Are you seeking admission to, into the infirmary? No? Oh, carry on then. Am I gonna have to, like, injure myself to get in here? I don't, I don't want to do that. Because it's not myself, it's Nico's self, and I feel bad. So, hopefully it won't come to that. Alright, well I think I've checked out this entire region, but I may have missed something here or there. I'm gonna give it a sweep, but... It's also about time that I end this episode. I'm trying to keep them a little bit shorter, because, you know... If you've been watching my Zelda series, they're half an hour each, and it takes a really long time to get all the stuff ready for that particular series. Um, which is simultaneous to this one. In case you weren't watching it, in case you're watching this in the future, I should stop dating my videos, huh? Whatever, it's fine! Um, cool. Well, thank you for watching. I'm glad we made a little progress here today. Got ourselves a gas mask and actually explore the rest of the Barrens. It seems relatively friendly. Oh, and incidentally, last time I did close down the window of one shot to try and, um, look up where that code was, and when I came back, Nico was alarmed. Uh, apparently things go black for Nico when I, am. Um, when I shut down the window, so apparently it wants me to do this all in one sitting, but that's not going to happen, so I hopefully Nico won't get too alarmed, but I well, can only do so much. Alright. Well, again, thank you for watching. Next time, we'll uh, explore the rest of the Barrens and see if there's anything else we need to do here before talking to that uh, row with a W bot back by the uh, docks. Yeah. See you then. This guy needs to chill out. Chill out, dude.